Stephen Emma here from Showrooms Online and today we're at Eiffel Manor by Bellway Homes and this house type of house today is the Radcliffe, a four bedroom show home. Now what I love about the Radcliffe is that it's actually got this beautiful mellow brickwork here, it's got a nice chimney, just look how cute it looks, you can see the detail in the lintels etc. I have to excuse any wind noise on this cat on this uh, VT, but a really really nice nice house with those sash windows etc. Without further ado, let's go and take a look. Welcome to Bellway Homes at Ivel Manor in Biggerswade. Yes. So this is the four bedroom detached Ratcliffe. Ratcliffe, what a yes. beautiful does it look from the outside. Lovely, beautiful Ooh. looking houses. Nice to be back in the Bellway. It is, but we're opposite to plan. Oh yeah. So that'll throw me. Okay then. Oh, I do like that. <laughs> <laughs> now that would be good for our office in our other life, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. How great. So we've got study, dimensions, two metres four by just over two metres. Yeah, it's got a little window in there. I like that very much. It is, it reminds me, <laughs> yeah, I'm not being funny, it reminds me of some sort of 70s, uh, not in a nasty way, in an in a untaithful way, but a 70s kind of bookshelf. <laughs> well it is a bookshelf. Yeah, but with the plants. The, okay. Downstairs loo. Oh, oh, why are we seeing that just lately? Oh, you see? Things that people have caught on that this is the way to go. So this is your downstairs WC and utility yeah. all in one. So we've got Zanussi appliances. Yes. Plenty of cupboard space. What's in here? I can hear him. Oh, oh no, no, it's not the boiler. No. It's the RCD box. It's the fan you can hear, oh, is I it? think. But very, very nice. We haven't got any dimensions for in here. No, okay, but it speaks for itself, doesn't it? Okay, living room. Love that wallpaper. Oh, we've got a kind of theme going on here with the plants. I can yes, see it now. It's a very natural theme. Right, living room, five metres five in length, three metres four in width. Very nice. Again, you've got the bay, but it's not a continuous bay, is it? It's no. three separate windows, yeah. which I like very I, much. What's they call it? It's like a 50 pence bay. Is it? Yeah. Oh, I've never if heard you, that same. If you before. think about the top of a 50 pence piece, yes. it's the same. Okay. I'll take your word for it. Well, I think it is. Yeah, right, I'm pretty okay. sure. <laughs> Don't write in. It's or good phone. Space. Good size. Yeah. I like it. Right. And then we're at the rear of the house. I'm not even there Sorry, yet. I'll wait for you. She's saying to me, pan around a lot more, and then I'm panning and she's off. Well, the viewers ask us to show them the house. That's our job, to show them the space. So this is the kitchen, dining, family area. Lovely. Dimensions for this room. Right, the kitchen area, three meters four by three meters four, just over. Family area, three meters four by two meters seven. Very nicely fitted kitchen. Let's have a look. Let's open some doors. What have we got? Fridge, freezer. Lots of cupboard space in there, isn't there? Single oven. Again, we're not sure about what's included, so it's always best to clarify yeah. that with the sales negotiators. We'll, um, give, we'll give you as much information as we can in the we description can show you what's box. here, but obviously it's down to individual packages for what you have. Right, lots of cupboard space. Eyeline cupboards, oiler, oiler, there we go. We've got integrated dishwasher there, cupboards under the sink, and your sink in front of the window yeah. there, so you can look at your lovely garden while you're washing up. Very, very nice. So you've got a, a four ring gas hob, and that's your extractor fan there, all fitted in. So they've got the dining table here in the middle. I suppose you could have it at the other end, couldn't you? Nice to have a sofa yeah. in here, though, somewhere else to sit. It is one of them open the space, open plan multi it is. spaces, it's isn't lovely. it? Lovely, yes. So you've got French doors there to the garden with the small windows either side. So you can open them a little bit of fresh air in. Very, very nice. Nicely yeah. um, landscape garden as well, isn't it? The shape on the stairs actually how it curves but we'll take a look upstairs hey then first floor now then i think because we're going to be back to front aren't we so there you'll have bedroom two which is at the front of the house 
really is the theme. It is, it's a natural theme. They've got fitted wardrobes. Bedroom two, three metres, three and a half by three metres one. That's your main bathroom with a sash window. Hmm. That's a nice touch, isn't it? Yeah. I like the tiling too with the mirror. Lovely. This feels a spacious bathroom, yeah, doesn't it? Yeah, it's light as well. Yeah. Okay. Hang on a minute. Let's. So all of them have got sash windows. Mm. Well, the ones at the front have. Yeah. I don't think the rear ones have. Well, we'll have a look. No, they haven't. Okay, so you're now in bedroom three. Dimensions, three meters two by two meters nine. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. So they've got some standalone furniture, a double bed, bedside tables, and it feels very spacious. So if we cut back across, you've got bedroom four then at the front. Green is the theme. Again, with the sash window. Oh, lovely with the pandas. Dimensions, bedroom four. Three metres six by two metres four. This is a cute room. Do you think you could fit a double bed in here? Yes, I easy. I think so. Easy. Yeah, you could. Easy. And two pandas. I mean, actually... There is enough room to swing a panda around in here. Yeah, beautiful. So then, last but not least, master bedroom. Just have a quick look at this landing a little bit, because it's almost like a, yeah. It's almost like you might could have put the bedroom door there. It's just it giving you that extra bit of land in there for the for yeah, the radiator. I think it, it, otherwise it would this would have been too enclosed, yeah. wouldn't it? So this is your master bedroom. Let me look for some dimensions. Three meters five by two meters eight. Oh, do you know what's lovely? Right. The houses over the back have all got their French doors open, so you can see how the inside-outside thing works. We're not going to snoop on the neighbours, but it's just to show you how airy and light these yeah. lovely houses are, and how the open-plan living works, I think. Yeah. Yes, bedroom one has got an ensuite. An ensuite. So we've got Rosh's um, sanitary road running through this house. Very nice interior design. The blind there in the ensuite matches the cushions on the bed. Yes. Beautiful as well. The fabric is lovely. Very, very nicely styled. So they've got some fitted wardrobes here along this wall. I think there's plenty of room for them, isn't there, in here? So what do we know about this development then? So we've got, I think, oh, there's a, there's in total, uh, it's, it was 300 homes altogether, yeah, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, Bellway are 118 of those. Yeah. Um, and there's there another is, developer, isn't there? Yeah. Yes, there is. There's, there's another developer on site. Um, he told us that we've got many local schools very close by, aren't yeah. there? Yeah, there's brand a, new schools as well. Absolutely. There's a retail park. All, all your standard yeah. amenities, doctors. Miggles Wade is, is, a, is, a, is a, a growing town now, isn't it? Yes, and also through the development, they've actually improved the rail links to London, so there's really good transport links. Yeah, well. and I noticed I was looking at, you know, perusing over the plan. There's lots mm -hmm. of open space for your children here, Lovely, yes. lots of parks and stuff, and it is right on the edge of the countryside. But it also, yes, it does. It feels very yeah. rural. Doesn't You're it? almost. It's very yes, nice. it is rural, yeah. yeah. But. A, in, in relative terms, a quite a new community, yeah. but there's a lot going on here. Yeah. It's very, very nice. Okay. Yes. Well, lovely. Well, that's a nice house type, isn't it? It is, yes. The Radcliffe. The Radcliffe by Bellway Homes. Yes. Um, yeah, ticks my boxes. Very nice. I love that saying. I, <laughs> I will put all the detail in the description box below, so don't get, forget to take a little look down there. Yeah. I mean, it's a, on the, um, in size of four beds, it's a, a smaller four bed than you do you know what I mean it's not it's 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 something if you want to move up from a three to a four this is ideal 
Yeah, I think it's adequately sized. Actually, yeah, I, mean, I think it's very nice. Yeah, well, I just yeah. think it's the next step up from the three. Mm, but with four good sized bedrooms. With four good sized bedrooms. You could put a double yeah. bed in every bedroom. Okay. Which okay. is useful. Well, obviously. I anyway. Don't, anyway. Let us know what you think because do you think it's a step up from a three bed? Do you think it's a good size four? Let us know because we make these videos for you viewers. You're the you're the critics. Yeah. You're you're the ones that are buying these homes so let us know what you think particularly if you're looking to buy on this development or if you're buying a bellway house we'd like to know we've got a brilliant bellway playlist on our channel as well if you mm. want to have a look at some of the other bellway designs yes but catch us on our next video and we'll see you soon Stephen Emma Sherms online